I have planned this wedding in the last part. We were like putting together a wedding in the forest and it's kind of like a red theme. And we also had an amazing proposal. The only thing is it is a Tuesday and I feel like in the real world, weddings on a Tuesday, probably not the best idea. Although it would be a good idea because it would be way cheaper and then everyone could get a day off work. Yay, but then also people need money, so maybe not a good idea. Um, but we haven't actually, what is, oh, he's feeling playful. I was like, why is it like, why is he all cuckoo? But he's just playful, that's nice. He's getting a little bit giddy for the wedding. Um, so it's actually eight o'clock at night right now. So I'm thinking we could have a midweek wedding. We can all try and get them into a good mood. Again, things are breaking all the time. Wait, broken things just seem to get mended overnight. Yeah, we're definitely doing that because we don't have time to be fixing stuff. We're already, we're already doing so much. Um, okay, Meadow did acquire the writing skill. Also, this is very laggy today. Haven't had this much lag for a while. I don't like that. I'm almost thinking I might have to restart my game. Oh no, we're back. It just took one, a new notification to come in that fixed it. Weird, really weird. So in terms of the wedding attire, this is Shay's formal wear at the moment. I feel like Shay could definitely go for something a little bit more fun for his wedding or super classic. I don't know. I feel like it's a rustic theme. There's gonna be a lot of red things around. I mean, did we wanna go for something really kind of farmy or do we wanna go for something more classic? It's hard to know. Like, I think he would look so good in this. Honestly, Shay can pull off whatever he wants to. <gasps> what about a full red suit? That, he, he looks really good in that. Oh, what's? What are the options here? Oh, that is so cute. I kind of like the more muted plum red color. This is like very red. So we're going with this slightly more casual but still formal suit jacket and hat for Huck because he likes to be a bit more relaxed. And then Shay has the really formal tuxedo, but they're tied in together by the same red colors that they've both decided they love and they wanted to be the theme of the wedding. And then that leaves Meadow, whose outfit I actually already designed when I created her. And I kind of love the fact that it goes with um, her brother and his fiance's outfit. So I feel like Meadow is totally set for the wedding in this gorgeous, like vintage looking dress. I think they're ready for the wedding and I'm just hoping that the relatives come in wedding appropriate wear. I actually do not recall what I put them in. <laughs> we'll soon find out. So they are ready for tomorrow's wedding on a Wednesday, but hey, it's gonna be a small intimate wedding. Their family have come in and are already here and not having to work, so, and they work on the farm so they can take, out time, take off time whenever they want. So it's gonna be perfect, I'm so excited. Oh look, they're like, I can't wait for tomorrow. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot the most important thing. I'm so silly, I've almost forgotten the unicorn outfit. Okay, we have to call out ramen, we have to feed ramen, we have to do so much. Um, you know what, let's get Hawk to collect the eggs because I'm just hoping that we got the eggs we need to create the rainbow treat in order to get the rainbow wool <laughs> in order to create the unicorn outfit because we cannot get married without them. Okay, let's just go into here. It looks like, oh no, oh no. I don't think we got the eggs we needed. From memory, we need to make a rainbow treat. We need like orange, blue and red, was it? Let me just go back here. I love how we've made our own little challenge that we have to do this in order to get married. <laughs> we have to do this. Where's the rainbow treat? So we need only a blue egg is the last egg we need because we have the orange egg, which I'm pretty sure we bought at the store. So we need a blue egg, you guys. Um, blue eggs can be made when we have the fishy treats, the fish protein treats. Do we have any more fish in our inventories? I don't think so. I wish we could also pick up the treats that the chickens haven't eaten, but I don't think we can, and we can't like force them to eat it. 
Such a waste. Well, we can see at 6 a.m. if they've laid any more, so I guess what we'll do is just get Meadow to go to bed, and hopefully in the morning we can get this final wedding outfit uh, created. We'll just give uh, Raman's house a bit of a clean and him a, a bit of a pick up because we don't want him to leave before the wedding. That would be an absolute disaster. Okay, it is almost 6 a.m. So let's go out to the chicken coop and collect eggs. Oh, the, the eggs are almost ready to collect. Oh my gosh. Okay, there's no eggs to collect. Okay, this, this chook house has some eggs. Wait, did I just... I thought I saw a blue egg, but I think it's hatchable. Oh my gosh, they're regular eggs. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh no. We didn't get the blue egg. Oh gosh, how else are we gonna get one? I think we're gonna have to go into town. I might take Shay to go for an emergency visit. Hopefully we'll have the store stocking an egg. Otherwise, I don't know how we're going to get it in time for the wedding. We might have to call the wedding off because I am not having Ram and attend the wedding not in a unicorn outfit. It's just not going to happen. Okay, these guys don't open these places until 9 a.m. So that's annoying. And they're just over here hanging out. Like, guys, seriously. <laughs> seriously. And I've already met these characters so many times. I don't know why we have to keep introducing ourselves to them. It's like they've got Dory memory. Okay, so just as a reminder, we are looking for a blue egg. I don't think we can get the blue egg from... Oh, actually, we did have a mystery box to open. I think we can get a mystery box too. Ah, <sighs> dear, dear, dear. Oh no, has someone else died? No, someone else. From losing a parent? <gasps> oh my god, his dad died right before his wedding. No, that is so tragic. Oh no. Well, guys, I think that's... We need that green egg. That's reason enough to call off the wedding today. And clearly, because we don't have the other egg, that's another reason to call off the wedding. <gasps> that is so sad. That's just really, really horrific. Oh man. Also, I don't know why Mrs. Crumplebottom's store's not open. Sheesh. Well, we better go visit his parents' house to see how they're holding up his poor mum and sister. That's so sad. The wedding's been ruined, you guys. Also, we probably should do some cooking for the wedding. That's another thing. So this is his parents' house and his sister Eva's here. Um... I mean, complain about problems. I don't think it's so much complaining about problems, but more just like expressing grief. That's really what he's doing. Um, maybe he can give her a funny gift to try and cheer her up. He's like, man, we're gonna miss dad so much. I mean, this is making me wanna cry, honestly. Oh, everything's gonna be okay. Sheesh kebabs. Well, maybe, Another idea I have is that we could move into this family home for Shay to look after his mom and his sister. Oh, there's eggs in here. I'm just going to collect them just in case there's a, there's a good egg. And through death, um, that does often bring families closer. Okay, that was an explosive gift. Maybe a little bit much for today, Shay. And you know, I think Shay's going to need to have a lot of support. Um, he's had a pretty rough time and he recently lost another elderly friend. We didn't know he was very close to this person, but he was. So he, he's going to need a lot of support through this. I believe this home, yeah, this home that I built is a much bigger lot. So we could move into this house. Um, although it would be a big change and I do love the current home we're in, but there would be room to expand it a little bit. And then we could look after his mom. I kind of think it's a good idea. Oh, he likes exercising. Wait, wait, where is his mom? What is she doing? Where did his mom go? Oh, she's in the bathroom. Oh no, what is she doing? Oh, she's on the phone. She's probably just coming to terms with the news and telling everyone. How's she feeling? Oh gosh. I mean, she's holding it together pretty well. Lose, just losing her husband but it did must be tough 
give fake bad news. That would so not be funny today. Aww. She's like, thank you for coming over, Shay. I mean, I think we should bring Meadow and Huck here as well to um, share their condolences with the Bex. All right, Huck's going to come in and brighten their days. Well, not really brighten their days. You can't really brighten their days, but just to be here for support. Oh, man. He definitely needs to give Shay a big, a big hug. Oh no, Meadows come over in her pajamas, which I guess Brianna Beck's finding quite amusing. <laughs> oh no, Meadows probably like, I came as soon as I could, as soon as I heard the news. But you know, Brianna's taking it pretty well. Like she kind of seems happy. Maybe she, I don't know, maybe she knew this was coming and it's a, partially a relief. But um, Shay's definitely finding it more difficult so i'm gonna let him ask for advice complain about problems maybe he can go to his old bedroom and cry it out a little bit mm, everything's gonna be okay but i feel like let me know in the comments down below how would you feel if we moved into this home it's a lot more space to expand a bigger lot and oh we would also get another llama which is kind of cool and oh i love that meadow goes outside to the llama to to give the llama her condolences as well even though the llama didn't really want them <laughs> oh poor shay okay well maybe i'll take meadow back home um to do a few things and to give these guys a little bit of space to grieve and she can keep going with the wedding preparations, AKA our llama unicorn outfit. Okay, I'm gonna fish with a lemon. Um, hopefully this is gonna catch something that we can make the protein treat out of. Okay, we caught a catfish. I almost, I feel like I wanna try and catch another fish so we can make a couple of protein treats. If we can just get one more. Okay, we, we got a goldfish. I think that'll be fine. And if we head home, we can then make the protein treats, feed them to the chickens, and hopefully in the morning, we will have the eggs that we need. We just need one more blue egg. That's it. And then we can make the rainbow treat. And then we can make the unicorn outfit. Woohoo! Oh, and it looks like we have um, crops to harvest as well. They're not the greatest crops, but they're okay. There is no time for rest, Meadow. You gotta... You gotta carry this family. She doesn't have to, obviously, but that's the kind of girl Meadow is. Make some fishy <laughs> treats. I guess the fishy treats are also made out of salad. Oh, Huck found a frog, that's exciting. Okay, let's give the white hen the fishy protein treat. And we also need to give another pumpkin treat to one of the hens as well. Okay, eat that up. Wait, I'm wondering, is the protein treat not even making a blue egg? Is it only making them lay a second egg? Oh my gosh, I've been feeding it the wrong dang treats. No, no wonder we're only getting two white eggs. I just assumed blue treat equals blue egg, which isn't the case. We need to feed a hen a fruity treat. Oh no. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I made that mistake. Oh, you guys must have been screaming at me. I don't think we even know how to make a fruity treat. Oh my gosh, so we need apple jam and blueberry jam, you guys. Oh, I cannot believe that. I'm gonna speed ahead until I get these ingredients to make this treat, all right? And then we will make the treat and get the hen to lay this final egg. This is an absolute mission, you guys. Okay, so at the store, I was able to buy some blueberry jam, but we're going to have to make our apple jam by ourselves. Luckily, I could also buy some apples, so we're going to be able to make the fruity treats. Thank gosh we have the recipe for it. I still can't believe this whole time I've been giving them protein treats, thinking that that would be what creates a blue egg. Oh my gosh. Super duper annoying. Okay, so now we have this. Don't you dare eat it. Wait, was he about to eat it? Oh, resume apple jam. Okay, I almost deleted the whole thing. <laughs> it's the impossible. Oh my gosh. Oh, don't stick your finger in there. Oh my lord. 
Okay, we've got that. I always get really worried the Sims are just gonna eat it and then we're gonna have to go back and do it all over again. Okay, now we can make the animal treats and get the fruity treat. And we're only going to yield one treat out of this. So this better work. Whichever hen we give this to better give us a blue egg. I mean, it has to, right? It has to. Did it work? Oh, thank gosh. <laughs> How is this treat common? Oh, which chicken died this time? Oh no. Oh no, who's going? Oh, is it Fluff's time to go? I'm sorry, Fluff. That's so sad. Okay, let's um give brown hens something. Just make sure they're not... Okay, they've got a normal egg so far. Let's give them a fruity treat. Oh, goodbye, Fluff. Oh, goodbye, Fluff. It was good knowing you. Oh, we have to put a uh, another... <laughs> Another tombstone in the garden. We haven't had a tombstone for a while. Actually, I think it's in one of, I think I had a spare in one of the inventories. In our little uh, chicken graveyard. I, ooh, we have mystery boxes to open too. I really do wish that we got little urns or stump something. Okay, we got some plant milk, which is quite nice. Uh, and now I'm confused with what other gift we got. Mm, potentially flower, potentially lemons. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what we just got there, but clearly nothing that stands out in a huge way. Oh wow, it is a bit of a heat wave today. Okay, let's put this little tombstone out here. Oh, can we not size this down? I thought we could from the inventory, but I'll size it down from by mood. Hello. There we go. This is Fluff's little tombstone there. Yay. Oh, yes, 6 a.m. blue egg harvest. Woo! Super exciting. Okay. Uh, and then the other thing is it looks like Shay's been okay with his dad's passing. My concern is that his mom's going to pass away as well or one of the gardener's um, parents are going to pass away as well. I should laugh. So I just want, you know, I want this wedding to happen tomorrow because we're running out of time. <laughs> um, so what we could do is cook some nice meals to put into a picnic basket for tomorrow. Um, so there's gourmet meals or we could just do some regular schmegular cooking. So let's just maybe put together some special foods. The other thing is a wedding cake might be a nice thing to have. Ooh, what about a mud cup? Uh, maybe let's just bake a pie. I feel like that's a classic. And then maybe Shay could also bake a wedding cake. He's cooking his own wedding cake. I mean, why not if you have the skills? Oh, actually we need some more sugar. Rat, rat. Ooh, prosciutto wrapped a asparagus sounds nice. Let's make some of those. Oh no, we can only make a single serving. Let's see if grocery delivery is working and get some sugar. <gasps> oh, I hope there is sugar. Oh yeah, okay, we can get some sugar. Actually, doesn't, oh, do we have sugar done. in our inventory? They're we just not. bought some. Oh my gosh, we have eight sugars, people. Okay, we don't need to go buy any. <laughs> oh well, we'll have extra if we need it. Okay, let's cook this black and white cake. Oh, you don't wanna cook it? Why not? Oh, you know what? He might want the tiered cake. I'm thinking he was um, saying, you know what? I need the tiered cake. Why can't you cook anything? What are you on strike? What? What's in the way of you cooking? Oh, cause Meadow's cooking. They can't cook two separate meals at once. Right. Oh well, we could all join in cooking then. That might be nice. Yay! Pre-wedding cooking fun. Yay, we're gonna make a pie. Oh, no one was around, so we left you a delivery on your lot. Sweet! I love these paper delivery bags. So cute. Okay, well maybe Shay can unload the delivery bag. Oh no, Cuckoo's going as well. Oh gosh, I really hope that, um... Wait, was it Brown Hen who has the harvest? Wait, who has the harvest? Who's got the blue egg? <gasps> oh no, I've forgotten who's gonna have the, the fruity egg. Did we already get the eggs we need? Oh, good lord. Guys, this could be really, really, really bad. Age, one last pet. What? Oh no. Well, it says they all have normal eggs, so. Two special eggs collected. <gasps> Guys, we got the blue egg. Yes. 
Yes, 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 yes. Oh my gosh, finally. <gasps> I'm so happy. Oh my gosh, we can finally cook the rainbow treat. Okay, we can't mess this up, you guys. We cook the rainbow treat. We give the rainbow treat to ramen. And then after ramen eats the rainbow treat, we get more rainbow wool, which is what is going to allow us to create the unicorn outfit. I think we just created the impossible we did. Yes. I'm so, oh my gosh, ramen is so dirty. Okay, I've been focusing so badly on ramen's outfit. We completely forgot about ramen. Okay, I'm so sorry, ramen, but this will totally be worth it. I know how amazing you want to look. Ooh, obsidian egg, not hatchable though, which is a shame. Okay, now we need to get Shay to cook the wedding cake. Ooh, we could have a winter cake. Actually, that seems a little bit more rustic for the wedding. Don't you guys think? Okay, let's give the rainbow treat to Ramen. Ramen, we have something special for you, honey. Ramen, please come out. I know, I know you feel really upset, but we promise you're gonna look so good in your new little outfit. <laughs> oh, Shay just reached cooking level skill 10. Hype. Okay, Ramen. Here, we're gonna give you a rainbow treat. Oh my gosh, come on. Okay, we this 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 has to move because Ramen's obsessed. It's like the hedge is Ramen's lover. <laughs> okay, don't lag, don't lag right now. We're so close. Okay, rainbow trait. Why do I feel like the game doesn't want us to to unlock this outfit? It, there's been so many hurdles to get through. <sighs> okay, finally, here's the rainbow trees. Yay! Nice one, Ramen. Nice one. Now, don't you leave us before the wedding tomorrow. <laughs> ah, the impossible outfit. Yay! Okay, now we have to go see the creature creeper, wherever he is, and we can get that uh that outfit made. Where is he? He's just over here somewhere. Ah, here he is. Ask to craft clothing. Oh gosh, I'm so excited. <gasps> the llama corn. Two rainbow wool and one pink llama wool. Oh my gosh, this is gonna look so good, you guys. Hey, can you please, pretty please make this for us? I really wish you didn't have the bag on your head. Excuse me, what are you taking a picture of? I know what it is with these, uh, these creature creepers. Okay, any minute now. Did Wait, did you make it? He didn't make it. He didn't make it. Excuse me? Excuse me? Okay, it's still there. I don't know, he like refused to make it for us. You have to make this for us. You broke my heart. I don't wanna make this for you. What do you mean? Um, If we cheer you up, I'm sorry, but this is really important. You don't know how hard we have tried for you to do this for us. Guys, it's, it's not working. You have to do this for us. I don't understand, why is it working? Okay, where are you? Did he go to bed? Yeah, he'll be right over. Maybe he just had to kind of refresh himself. Maybe he had to go grab a few things, you know? These things happen. Oh my God, we're about to pass out as well. Just go, just go nap here until he, until he arrives. Where is he? Oh my God, he's at our house, right, okay. Okay, this is very, poetic up here on the balcony, but is this what you wanted? You wanted to be invited over? Maybe he has no friends and he needed to be invited over to a house. Is that what it is? Why doesn't this work? Do you just have it for sale by chance? Okay, that's pretty cool. I think he'll get that. But seriously, why isn't it working? Oh my God. Okay, if we buy other things, will you, maybe we have to like get to know him more. Maybe he doesn't like us. Maybe we'll just like, suck up to him a little bit. Even Hawks here is like, dude, just make the dang llama corn outfit. I know if you know me, but I'm Huck and I'm actually getting married tomorrow. Matter it's like, look, it's tomorrow. would really appreciate it if you could just make this for us. <laughs> Come on. He's not, he's not doing it. Okay, I'm gonna try and restart the game and see if he makes it. 
Okay, guys, I think I'm the reason why he won't Good make day. the outfit is because we don't have a strong enough relationship with him. Because whenever I ask him to, he gets really annoyed at us. So I'm thinking asking at four in the morning probably isn't the best time. So in the next part, hopefully we can do that and get married. Sorry the wedding's been delayed another day, but thank you guys so much for watching. I promise in the next part it'll happen. I hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. I look forward to speaking to you all soon. Zack, Zack!